English opening, Fianchetto, ultra-symmetrical line, 5.d3. Intense that was a serious game. White really outplayed black in that one. The opening was balanced. That was a well-fought middle game that white got the better of. The players battled pretty evently in the end game. In the English opening, white plays c4 to take control of the d5 square without sacrificing a central piece. This is a more patient opening. g6 prepares to fianchetto the dark squared bishop on g7, where it will attack the center from the long diagonal. And c3 controls the d5 and e4 squares and advances the knight. The move c5 occupies the center, takes possession of the d4 square, and positions the knight to advance behind the c-pawn. The bishop will be better off as a result of this. Fianchetto move bg7 places the bishop on the long diagonal. Fianchetto move bg2 places the bishop on the long diagonal. And c6 develops the knight toward the center and controls the e5 and d4 squares. d3 protects the c4-pawn allows the dark squared bishop to develop, and controls e4. Games master. It is the final book action. This misses a chance to make a pawn winning threat. It is incorrect. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. That's good. This wastes a chance to build a bishop outside of its starting square. It is incorrect. This misses a chance to advance a rook from its starting square. It is incorrect. There were worse maneuvers, but there were also much better ones. It is incorrect. The bishop will be better off as a result of this. That's good. This passes up a chance to seize a helpless pawn. It is incorrect. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. This is the only good move. It is a great move. By moving a rook from its starting square, this activates it. That's good. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. This threatens to kick a knight. It is good. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. It is good. Castling develops a rook while also moving the king to safety. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent tends to lead to less sharp positions as compared with opposite side castling. It is best. It's alright. That's good. This is a missed chance to kick a knight. It is incorrect. This provides an equal exchange of parts. It is ideal. A pawn kicks the opposing knight, forcing it to move or risk being captured. It is ideal. The knight is now located at an outpost, a safe area inside the enemy's territory. This poses a fork piece threat. It is ideal. This strikes a rival knight. That's good. The knight is thus brought to safety. That's good. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This prevents the opponent from being able to fork pieces. It is good. Recaptures. It is quite good. The knight is thus brought to safety. It is quite good. This overlooks a better way to strike at the center with a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. This strikes a rival knight. It is ideal. This suggests exchanging items of equivalent value. This poses a material threat. It is ideal. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. Recaptures. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. This forks pieces by creating a simultaneous attack. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This protects the bishop who was attacked. It is ideal. This wins material. This is the only good move. It is best. Recaptures. It is ideal. This succeeds in capturing a helpless rook. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. Not the finest, this. It is incorrect. This could have been done lot better. 
it is incorrect. This is not the best approach. It is incorrect. Although the score was nearly equal, White now has the upper hand. It is incorrect. Although White had had the upper hand, the game is now almost even. It is incorrect. This moves away from the queen of checking. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. The game was almost evenly matched, but black is now worse. It is incorrect. This loses a chance to imply that winning a pawn is possible. It is incorrect. There was only one good move in that position. It is a mistake. This is an equal trade. This is the only good move. This was a game-changing move, giving white a winning position. It is best. Recaptures. Black is losing because the end game has begun. It is ideal. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. Thus, the attacked pawn is protected. That is good. This provides an equal exchange of parts. It is ideal. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. A wise decision. It is quite good. This uses a pawn to attack the center while vying for position. That's good. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. The bishop is currently located at an outpost, a safe square within the opponent's domain. It is quite good. That pawn was available for free. It is ideal. The pawn is now in a safe position. It is ideal. This misses a chance to pose a pawn winning threat. It is incorrect. That is a logical response. It is quite good. There were worse maneuvers, but there were also much better ones. It is incorrect. That is a regrettable error. It is incorrect. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. A powerful play. It is quite good. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is quite good. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. That's a decent move. That's good. Among the best actions. It is quite good. This moves the checking rook farther away. It is ideal. A wise decision. It is quite good. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. This raises the possibility of an eventual checkmate. It is incorrect. This allows a forced checkmate. This threatens to promote a pawn to a queen. There was only one good move there. It is a blunder. This forces an eventual checkmate. This took advantage of a mistake and white now has a winning advantage. This stops the opponent from being able to promote a pawn to a queen. It is a great move. Intense that was a serious game. White really outplayed black in that one. The opening was balanced. That was a well-fought middle game that white got the better of. The players battled pretty evently in the end game.